When uploading a website to an actual live server, first thing we need to do is we need to have an actual website. So this is a very simple website, simple HTML, some styles over here. Structure wise, we've got two folders, one index page, video and so forth. The website itself looks like this, okay? Now, assuming you've purchased a domain, there is a high chance you will end up with this thing called cPanel. cPanel is the back end of most websites. What you're looking for is you're looking for file manager. So what you would do is you would click into file manager here. This will give you a list of everything that you have on your system. So take for example here, I wanna create a new one inside my public HTML folder. I'm gonna create a brand new folder. There we go, up there. I'm gonna call this guy test. And we'll create a new folder like this. Now, what that's done is this is the domain of the website at the moment. So if I go here and type in test and hit enter, as you can see, this now gives me an empty folder. What we wanna do is we wanna upload files. So we go into here and then we can click on the upload. Notice this now has the ability to drag and drop. So as you would expect, go into here and drag and drop stuff. So once we've got one in there, what we wanna do is we wanna go back and then we can create inside here our folders for our CSS. And then create a folder for our media. So let's go to our CSS first. We'll upload here. We'll come to this point here, grab the style sheet, upload it as such. We'll then go back from here, then drop down to the media folder. So we double click inside that, click on upload, find the media item that we have locally, and upload it this way. Now this is the simple way of doing it when you don't have a lot of files, otherwise you would be looking at using what's called FTP to do it. And to do FTP, you'd create an FTP account and then you would assign the correct folders that you could upload to. So now that all that information has been uploaded, if we hit refresh, you'll see the site is now up live and it's working off this system here. So if we play on there, our video goes and we're done.